Well, good evening. I'd, I'd like to be with you tonight to receive this honor, but how's that song go? Don't get around much anymore. But I did want to tell you that I've always wanted to be an oil man, and it started when I was 10 years old, and it was near Longview, Texas, where I watched my dad and his partners bring in one of the discovery wells of the East Texas field. And when that Lathrop number one roared in for 18,000 barrels a day, my dad and his associates were wading around in their knee boots in the slush pit, which was covered with oil. Oil was going in over their boots, and they were throwing their hats in and having one heck of a time. And I tugged on my mother's coat, and I said, Mother, when I grow up, I want to be an oil man. And that never changed. And when I got out of Culver Military Academy in 1937, it was going to, I wanted to get a petroleum engineering degree. And there was only three schools at that time, the University of Pennsylvania, Stanford, and Texas, that offered petroleum engineering. And naturally, I came to Texas being the major oil state. And I earned my degree. And I worked for uh, Standard Oil, Oil of Indiana about a year. And the rest of the time since then, I was with my dad until he died right in the office uh, when he was 91 years old. And even now, I'm probably in one of the biggest and most exciting deals I've ever been in. It's called the Davy Jones play, which was uh, cooked up by Jim Bob Moffat, and I know all of you know him, who runs Mike Moran Oil and Gas Exploration. And I think we we all think that we have a discovery already, a gas discovery in the Gulf of Mexico, and we have three big rigs operating in less than 500 feet of water now. And if that play hits, it's going to be the, well, the tremendous culmination of my dad's and my career. And again, I want to thank you very much, and it's uh, I'm proud that names like Dan Williams, Ernest Cockrell Jr., Bob Parker Sr., Lois Folger, and Rus Russell Parker will forever be associated with UT Petroleum Engineering. And the deep and rich history of this department is built upon the alumni who passed through UT's halls and the professors who taught us, even if I thought a few of them are rather quirky. But together, we have pioneered the oil and gas industry in Texas and around the world. It's true, what starts at UT truly does change the world. I know it changed my world. I want to thank you again for this honor. And always remember, UT PGE number one.